Space Babes, it's Ellie, and today I have a Meet the Artist. I know I've already done this one before, and I know it's not that many videos ago, but it was about, I want to say like two years ago? So things have changed, my art has grown, I've grown, and I feel like an update is just time, and I have new goals, and just I'm ready to share. I have no idea what to talk about in most of these videos, so I'm just going to talk about myself, because that's something I kind of know about. I briefly wanted to show you guys how I prep my watercolor paper. If you're interested in seeing my whole process and how I do it, I don't know if it's correct, but it's just how I work, um, please let me know down in the comments. Love to know how you prep your watercolor paper. Do you prep it? What kind of watercolor paper do you use? Because I know for me, I'm so overwhelmed by how many brands there are that I just... I just grab the one I know then use over and over, which is just okay, but I would love to get something better. For this painting, I decided I didn't really want to do a self-portrait because I'm still sick of them. I know it's been so many years since college, but I probably did over a hundred of them in a few years and I still don't want to draw myself. Thank you. So I took like all the qualities and features of myself and things that I like onto just a, a girl and she just happens to have, you know, my brown curly unruly hair with my cotton candy blue and pink, not Harley Quinn, totally didn't plan that, totally my bad. Instead of doing the flower crown, I put things that I like or that I'm interested in. So I put in my new perky bird. He's so cute. I still don't know what to name him. If you have any ideas, also comment that down below. He's just so cute. And then, of course, you can probably see all the cute clips. I'm totally in love with him, and so is my dog. She's been staring at him nonstop. She's even, like, climbing on my studio furniture just to see him better. It's so cute. I know she wants to eat him, but there's a part of me that thinks that it's, like, you know, long-lost animal love. <laughs> But anyway, so like other things in uh, her hair, my hair, is like, you know, a fluffy 90s pencil because I draw and then paint brushes. They put a little uh, pin, a little pin circle thingy with some pins because I've been into sewing lately and I'm getting into costumes and I got huge things going on this year. I'm so excited. I'm working on them now, but I can't show them until the end of the year. So, ah, <sighs> shoot. <laughs> And then I also added some flowers and a paint tube because, you know, I'm an artist. And some aliens and the necklaces I wear. I just threw all the clutter that I usually like of my life and just threw it into this character. And I really like how it turned out because it was also a chance for me to learn how to watercolor. You can also see little hints of my dogs in my uh, alien necklace because I didn't want to put, like, literal dogs in my hair. I thought that was weird. Like, the bird can work. The dogs? Okay. <laughs> You guys should definitely be following me on my Instagram. It's the same username, at L-E-R-X on Instagram. And I post all my pictures, all my aliens and space babes. It's probably where you found me from. And um, I just couldn't help myself putting her, you know, with the moons and Saturn rings. I'm like, come on, girls. She looks cute. I wish I could have those earrings. Somebody want to make those for me, please? <laughs> I love you forever. Something about me that you might already know if you've seen my other videos is that I was initially an art history major because I just love it so, so much. I did not finish get my full bachelor's in it. I do have an AA, um, but it was only because of a few class scheduling issues and drama. So instead, I, I love to draw all my life. So I was like, uh, drawing, hell yeah. <laughs> I have two fluff monsters. One is Tilly the Black Furry Burrito, the brick with sticks. That's what we call her because she's so fat and her tiny dog legs hurt when she walks on you. <laughs> brick with sticks. And then I have my little boy Niles, my little old man. Um, I actually, if you get confused, I call him Potato too because when he sleeps, he looks like a little potato. <laughs> and I also, of course, you've seen my new bird that has no name. I love him. <laughs> While I love to do watercolor and flat traditional art with all my heart, I really, really love to do 3D mixed media art. I really need to get back into it. I used to do big sculptures with cardboard as a recycling project and covering it in um, different like glitters and I used to cover it in different things to, you know, draw uh, attention to it and I miss all those things. I even have almost like a partial Animal Crossing world built but it's not enough to where it's like I can show you because they're all half done. 
So plan on seeing a lot more mixed media and sculptures and all sorts of different things coming up because there's a, since it's summer, I'm going outside, I'm going to go out, and I have a lot of ideas for this summer. I am so excited. Like, I'm sure you guys can already tell, like, what are my favorite colors. Neon anything, but specifically probably neon green or neon pink. And then I love any animal. I love The Office. 100%. Oh my god. I one time went to go see the building. I just stood there. I was like, oh, I am at the building. This is where they were. I'm just going to stand here. And it was a great day, actually. That's a whole other video. I'll have to tell you guys about that later, about my experience, because I do want to do office fan art. Okay, I'm just spoiling all the things I want to do. It's just an, my idea, just bleh. I really don't know what else there is about me other than dogs, rainbow colors, and art. Like, <laughs> I do yoga. I watch a lot of cooking shows. Oh, God, cooking shows, Master Chef, Hell's Kitchen, Gordon Ramsay. <laughs> I'm one of those people. I'm sorry. That's like my, like, that's my fangirl. Not sorry. I am secretly, but not secretly, a uh, reality TV show junkie. My number one picks are things like Survivor and Bachelor, Love Island. Oh my god, I need another season on Hulu. I am one of those people. I don't know why, but peop like watching other people do stupid things cracks me up. I'm sorry. <laughs> like, maybe it's just because, you know, I'm just stuck doing art sitting here in my quiet, happy little room. I just need some drama and spice in my life, and that's why I watch it. That makes sense. I'm gonna go with that one. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you love the painting I drew. I do plan on doing more. I'm hoping to do commissions eventually with these paintings. We will see, like I just gotta get through this week and then we'll go from there. So until next time for next week, which is a special collab with a lot of my friends. So please come back next week and watch all their videos. I am so excited to share what we have all made. And so until then, I will see you guys later. Bye.